Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boys Frogan Reactions here, back with another video. Yep. And today's the final day, the final recap. The Stanley Cup final has been awarded. Let's get right into it. Recapping the 2024 playoffs and the 2023-2024 season as a whole, the Oilers and the Panthers took on each other in the finals, and boy, oh boy, was this an entertaining series of seven games. So Who knew it was gonna go to seven. Florida winning all three games, the the the, the first three games, by a score of three nothing, four one, and four three. Then they go back. So they're yeah. facing elimination. They're facing elimination. Edmonton could just lay down and die, mm -hmm. put them away, and Florida Panthers becomes your first, uh, their first franchise Stanley Cup. And it would be boring. And it would be okay. No, but Edmonton doesn't fall asleep quietly. Mm -hmm. They win the next three games by a score of eight one, four three, and five one. So they won game four. They dominated. The Buffalo is like. Eh. Okay, well, they're gonna win it at home now. Yeah, sure. Nope, they couldn't pull out in the last two minutes, or whatever, to tie the game, and it stayed 4 3 Edmonton, and that planted the seed of doubt in Florida. Because then they went back to Edmonton and they won 5 1, and now Florida was shitting their pants because the owner was pissed. They were all pissed because if they didn't win, Oh my. Bill Zito Lord. was throwing his water bottle around. Yeah. Paul Maurice was looking for answers. They said, is uh, luck uh, whatever, he, whatever he said and then he believes it doesn't exist. That was something interesting. Paul Maurice always gives a good interview. But it came down to a game seven and boy was it entertaining. Florida ends up scoring the first goal. Yeah. And then Edmonton ties it. Then Florida scores the second goal, Sam Reinhardt, and goes into the third period with a 2-1 uh, lead. And then, unfortunately, they win. Yeah, the Edmonton Oilers lose. And the cup is staying Dang. south. It is not coming back to Canada. And the 30-year Canadian Cup drought continues. Who will break it? I don't know. I'd love for the Leafs to do it, but we're here back to square one. So, um, so Zach Hyman, they're all Cody CC, all former Leafs on the Edmonton team, does not get their Stanley Cup. But guess what? It isn't a former Le It isn't a Stanley Cup final without some former Leafs because the winning team had some as well. Carter Verhage. Evan Rodriguez, who he acquired in a trade from Pittsburgh, then sh shipped him out. And then? Then he walked in free agency, actually. Then the head coach, oh, Paul nice. Maurice, coached the Toronto Maple Leafs for two seasons and got canned because and the he Leafs had the audacity to say. I mean, there are a lot of people that are giving him respect for this, saying that I, he hopes Winnipeg is the next. If he could have Stanley one more champion. thing. If he could have one more thing, is that the Winnipeg Jets wins the Stanley Cup. And you don't mention the Leafs. But hey, at the end of the day, I respect Paul Maurice because he not only not only spent his most of his coaching tenure in Winnipeg, but he showed respect. He could have been, you know what? I hope whatever team wins the, I hope America we win the next Stanley Cup as well. 
Nobody wants the Winnipeg Jets, which is his former team, to win the Stanley Cup next. So your 2024 Stanley Cup champions are the Florida Panthers, Panthers. with Carter Verhage, Evan Rodriguez, and none other than Paul Maurice. Wow. There's your team photo there. Roberto Luongo is a special assistant to the GM. Matt, Brady Kachuk in the stands wants to see Matthew Kachuk win his first Stanley Cup in the family. And I just love to joke how Brady's like, oh my god, it's so beautiful. I'm like, yeah, dream buddy, because you ain't getting it on Ottawa. Ottawa trading for Linus Allmark now. They're really going to make a push, aren't they? They really want to make those playoffs. And that's it. That, and that's, that's, it. that's the end of the 2024 Stanley, Stanley Cup, Cup playoffs. So it was not the way we, we wanted to as Leaf fans. It was heartbreaking. Uh, I kind of predicted, though, that Florida First round win. exit with Boston. Nothing has changed. Not one bit. Nothing. But we'll see what the Leafs need to do in order to motivate their... But we have an entertaining offseason ahead of us because we all know that Brad Tree Living likes to build his team in the offseason, not at trade deadline. He believes the team is made during the offseason. Trade deadline is only for tinkering around the edges, no big splashes. So and we'll see. I agree with that. So, hey, free agency's in a week. The draft's coming up. Big trades could happen. Big signings could happen. Lots needs to be done to improve this team. And you're um, 2024 Stanley Cup champions are the Florida Panthers. So that's it, signing off for the final time of this hockey season, and here we go into the offseason. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.